filming here. No, I'm not filming. <laughs> Hello and welcome back to the channel. My name is Mike, you're watching Spud Boys TV. And today, ladies and gentlemen, is going to be a good day. Why, Mike? Why is it such a good day? Well, because we're going on an adventure. <laughs> Where are we going? Um, Taldycock Castle. Oh, going to go and explore an awesome castle. So we have come to Caldicott Castle. Caldicott, Caldicott. Caldicott and um, the door shut so we don't know if we can get in <laughs> we are just checking now on Google on the Google I am eight well, it says it's only open between April and October oh no we could do Caldicott town we'd have a little look around if you want to yeah, let's have a look around and then go into the town let me have a look, look in town that sounds like a plan doesn't it <laughs> sorry guys I didn't realise it was only open certain times of year. That's okay. I'm really interested in these little archways here. Yeah? Mate, it's sort of. We'll have a look around. I want to see if I can... Can you go in them? Mm -hmm. We'll have a look. That's what I'm interested in. <laughs> and obviously, we got a man there in the back. You can't see it because the the class. We've got like a little park by here, guys, if you if you fancy coming down the park. Obviously, this place in the summer would be amazing to come. I like it in the winter, though. Well, not the winter. It's not really winter now. But I like it when it's like this, see? Because it's all like... All derelict. Well, the leaves have fallen down. Here she is, I am eight. Hiya. <laughs> there he is, everyone. <laughs> Hello. Here she is, look at Hello. this. Should we go try and get a thumbnail? <laughs> thumbnail. Maybe, I don't know. <laughs> so we're going to go check out the castle, even though it's shut, but, you know, you might find a way in. <laughs> <laughs> trying to do a sneaky these guys can get in can, can you see the sea hmm. some information here about the castle guys you can from the top of the castle's tower well guess what it's shut so we're not going to be able to see the sea <laughs> it's going to be locked but we may as well give it a go <laughs> it's not going to hurt anybody I wonder, is there people in there then do you think possibly I reckon does anyone live there? <laughs> we've got like big bee, when we were here, there were big beehives in the walls. Oh. And it's quite common to be some beehives in. The warnings. It's amazing though, isn't it? How like, how like humans made this. Back in the day when they didn't have like trucks to carry on. Well, look, obviously that used bricks. to be a motor, but it looks like. It's awesome, isn't it? Look at the old drawbridge. Oh. Hiya mate. That's a nest. <laughs> oh. It moves. <laughs> the doors move a little bit if you pull them. Shall I ring the bell? Like you open, mate. How you make you open? Cameras are there, eh? Office. Yes. Is that your mum? Guess not. Someone's pushing the buzzer to the main gate. <laughs> That's a shame. I was actually looking forward to going in there. We got it. And doing things we shouldn't be doing, Craig. Oh, let's go and have a look around, mate. Yeah. So this, you reckon this used to be like an old moat? I reckon so, yeah. Definitely. Born December the 3rd, I think. Yes. Me and Craig have found a secret entrance into the castle. What have we got, mate? Well, oh, that is very disappointing indeed. <laughs> It's kind of cool though to see the kind of like how we used to yeah. be. Think about it, if you look at that moat, if that was full of water one one time, we would have been none the water would have been over our head then. Yeah. It'd be about to you, wouldn't it? Yeah. Roughly. Go 
Hmm. Yeah, look at the size of the bricks, though. They must have like. I reckon. How did they even? How do you even build a castle, mate? <laughs> I reckon it's been probably part rebuilt. Do you reckon? So fascinating, isn't he? Hmm. I've not done a sniff yet. <laughs> I'm gonna get Craig to do a sniff. <laughs> oh, oh, we go do that. What do you think these were for, Craig? See, this would have been from the water. Hmm. Do you think these used to be like old ways into the uh, like the sewage system? Oh wow, look at this. Mmm! <laughs> <laughs> I did a sniff of the castle! Are there rabbit holes, are they? I see a little bit in there, but there's no benches. Benches? Oh, bastards. Oh, yeah. Here you go, guys. Inside Caldecott Castle. I have to walk down this dangerous slope of death. <laughs> Yeah, these are really interesting though. I don't know what they were. What they could have been for. Oh, look. Some sort of old structure. <laughs> Maybe these were little prisons. I do find it fascinating though. How someone built these like back in the day. Look, you can see all the old building and stuff. Ugh. <laughs> oh, we found a back gate for deliveries. There's another one. <laughs> oh, I know. It's padlocked, it's just not there. Bastards. Hello, mate. We're famous YouTubers coming to check it out. <laughs> no. Hiya, mate. <laughs> Ooh. Taking this with me. <laughs> I've got a souvenir of the castle. <laughs> Mine. <laughs> oh, it's like a pond over there, is it? Oh yeah. yeah. And that was we empty. Walked we walked on it. Oh what? We literally so, walked into the middle of it. It's like like fishing. I hope not. I, 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 I hope not. When we came here, there's no fish in there. <laughs> <laughs> it does look like a nice castle, mate, doesn't it? Oh, it's, mate, it's really nice in there. Really nice in there. Behold, Caldicott Castle, ladies and gentlemen. Unfortunately, though, we can't bring you any information on it because it's shut. <laughs> but there is another entrance by here. What's that? A bridge. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Look, mate. It looks like. At one time, they. Oh, yeah. A pathway or something by there. But that would have been going into the moat. The moat that's the word. Do you know the holes and stuff? What are they for, Craig? They for on castles. I'm not sure if they're for fire. Those holes there, Sean, are they like for firing arrows and all? Yeah, yeah, defense holes. Bloody hell. That sounds a little bit dirty, don't it? A defence hole. I'll try and get Craig to do a sniff now. I'll actually do a sniff in a minute. This is fun, isn't it, guys? Just exploring a castle. We can't get in there, though. There's another entrance there. Pointless getting... 
risking my life going down and up for it to be shut. It's going to be locked in it. They're not going to like not have the door locked. But you never know if you don't go. <laughs> Could go up there. Yeah, so at least you can't. At least you're seeing the outskirts of the castle, which is not too bad, I don't think. Oh, look at this, where the where the part of the tree's fallen off. It's very interesting, isn't it? It'd be cool to have a time machine and go back like two thousand years. I don't know how long. I don't know how long the whole this castle is. However old the castle is, um, and just being here with the moat. Craig has found a pathway. How steep is that? <laughs> I'm gonna watch you from afar. Because then if you slip, it's good content. <laughs> Here he goes. Oh! <laughs> Are you made there? Ah, you didn't fall! <laughs> they may take our lives, but they may never take our freedom! <laughs> I know. Look, <laughs> man. Have a look at these views, man. It's pretty amazing up here, to be honest. Um, I'm not going to go up there, by the way, guys. <laughs> Just in case you're like... Mike, why don't you follow Craig up that massive steep hill? No! One does not want to die today. Craig's hard. Here he is. Anything up there? No. Do not take that camera off him as he comes back down. <laughs> you, need to, you need to pause that camera now. <laughs> Never! <laughs> You can get down by there, Craig. Huh? You can get down by there. <laughs> Just jump. <laughs> right, guys, I'm not going to take the camera off Craig while I'm recording this, just in case he has a little stumble. <laughs> yes, Craig. <laughs> Everyone hit that like button, <laughs> just in case he falls. <laughs> filming, no, I'm not filming. <laughs> I know you're a trained professional. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> to a lesser man, that would have been difficult to get down, but to a trained professional of the trade, I'm the Spartan. <laughs> yeah. Well, that's what I'm saying. If I get all the kids' goggles, like, you know? Yeah. Bridge of Kazazum. Kazazum. Well, that's actually quite deep, isn't it? Babe, go and step in there, see how deep it is. Every time we go on a path, we look for a troll under the, um, under the bridge. bridge. That's fairly Maybe deep. Bridge. I would have to move my stick. No, that's too deep, that. that is deep. That's probably up to you, up to you maybe. I can move the tiles <laughs> We are certifying that as deep. As deep. <laughs> when um, I think it's through the war, when there was lack of housing, the owner turned it into flats. Oh, so, yeah. um, it's inside, it doesn't look yeah, like it's all like it's a accommodation yeah. and everything, and this is for small families or new couples, and it was their own community inside. What? So what? The towers what? I wonder were if like that's what those buzzers are called. Ah, maybe, yeah. Um, and then they had like, <laughs> the community inside the castle. When was that in World War II? Um, um, I think it must have been post war when there was housing shortages. But it's got pictures of all the people that were living there, like outside their flats and stuff. That's really interesting. What's that about? It's a week to gate closes. Oh. So it's a closer day. Oh yeah. <laughs> I'm quite uh, I'm quite impressed with that. What a great piece of modern engineering. We came out this way, we walked into the pond that way, we walked into the middle. 
and there was no water. How long ago was that? It's during last summer. When we had that drought. Oh yeah, when the weather was bad. Yeah. Well, not bad. But like really but. dry. Yeah. Hmm. I wonder what this is. I found a medieval drain. Yeah, it says it's medieval. Maybe this like leads into. Okay, we can open this. It was built in 1100. We can open this. I can't open it. I think if you had something, you could pull that out. Something. Trick us like a tunnel leaning into the castle. Ooh. Yeah. Craig, spud boy tradition, mate. Spud boy tradition, you have to do a sniff. <laughs> hmm. <laughs> I got cold. That's about nothing. <laughs> Come on. Come on. Oh, it's Can you imagine a tide lapping around your feet here? It did about 3,500 years ago when the Bronze Age trading vessels navigated. Oh, so the boats used to come in here. Like that. I used to look like that. They used to sew it, and then they used to use um, moss and beeswax to waterproof the holes. It's interesting, isn't it? It's weird, isn't it, technology, and how people used to use stuff like that. Same picture. What's you this? What? That's oh, yours, is it? Is that sneak? Yeah. I've got the cans and the um, powder. They're really nice. That same picture. Same picture this time last year, look at that. Well, last right. summer. You're not gonna well, see it, but. I'll do. I'll put that there. Three, two, one, boom. How long ago was that, Craig? This was last. Was it last summer, Sean? When we had that drought? Look at that. It's mad. It's taking the exact same place. We walked out to it and we walked all around there. <laughs> so the water was just literally just by there and there was no water at all over there. It's mad, isn't it? Yeah. You see the black stuff there? It literally just popped up uh, from the from the floor. That's the first, yeah. yeah. It's oh, it just is. that's not frog spawn, is it, Sean? It just popped up from the from the floor. Fungi. So, Fungi. The Last of Us. <laughs> There you go, Shona. That's how they filled up the pond. Is look from the from the from the tap. <laughs> we have to let Louise know what we have planned for. <laughs> we tried messing with that last time. I think they turned the water water off, didn't they? But we were in a drought, so. What is that for, do you reckon? If this is farmland, it's probably just going to pop. We shall investigate. Yeah, there's not even a thing on it. It's fine, no? Last time they had a handle on it. Coffee's gonna pop. They're like farm socks. Ha! Turn around a minute, Shona. Turn oh. around a minute. Turn around a minute. Ha ha ha! Yes! <laughs> Don't jump in the pond, Shona. Don't jump in the pond, Shona. Get it off. Let's make some content. How did the, did the drinking bird shout on you, is it? That won't be the first time. When I was pregnant with Dylan, we walked in through um, Cardiff Bay one there. Big fat belly mind, you know, big fat and pregnant, steps out of the car and I've got a beautiful green maxi dress on. Big belly. Middle of summer, we've oh. literally, do you know where TechniQuest is on kind of Bay? Yeah, yeah. Car park over there. We literally just walked up to that car park. <laughs> we just got there. Mate, but it wasn't like, it wasn't like a bird shit. It was almost like a human in the sky <laughs> shitting it was that much. Oh, and do you know what? Man. She just went, she just went. <laughs> We're back here, she cleaned herself off and we carried on going. Oh mate, you see, I've never seen it. was in her hair, Shoulder, everywhere. Hair, all day, me big belly on my bed, everything. It was almost like ten seagulls got together and went, and just let's, let's, yeah, let's all do it. Let's all do it. Hey mate, you're right. Or, or it was like someone took like a, a thing of um, custard over her. Like that, it was literally. <laughs> all day, me hair, I don't like poo. shoulder, belly, everything. Can't handle poo. Brum brum. 
Look at this, guys. So this has been to Iraq and Afghanistan. Oh, wow. <laughs> oh, it's... Yeah, it's, it's, we've got newer ones now. It's quite it? high, though, is it? It don't look like that in the films. <laughs> no, it's supposed to be, so you've got goggles on. It's, oh, the yeah, old ones yeah. are low, and when you have goggles on, it reflects on the goggles. And... It's a thing, right? Because I know from, from, from helmets and stuff that... They're not designed to stop bullets, are they? No, it's to stop the shockwave, isn't it? How many designed? If a, if a bullet hits them, it, it, it'll deflect them off. Ah, so, okay. Yeah, so it won't, if you head on like that, it won't stop it. It's just designed to... It would, shat, it would shatter the... Yeah, the, it would deflect the bullets away. Well, there you go. Look at that, guys. They're the old ones. We've got new ones now. <laughs> I'm in the army, mate! <laughs> I don't know. I'm going to have to put a... That's why you should have is Like, do you know how I have this as the staple cap? You should have that helmet as a staple <laughs> spud boy thing. Yeah, the helmets are not, not enough for you, to be honest. <laughs> well, they've yeah. probably got bigger ones for, for me. <laughs> I've got a handout back in, so they give me a new one to go on my course. So. Yeah. It's a shame, because obviously I've had that for so many years. Like. Yeah. So what we're going to do now, we're going to go We're gonna go check out Caldecott Town now, guys, because unfortunately we can't get in the castle. We did have a walk around, which was really interesting, wasn't it? Yeah. We've seen a couple of cool stuff. Very picturesque. Mm, it's very pretty. But, um... I've taken the, the wide-angle lens off now, guys, so I might be a little bit closer to the camera. Ooh. Ooh. What's that smell? What smell that? It smells like bird shit. <laughs> oh, you should be bastard. <laughs> <What's going on? laughs> I'm only joking. So we've come to Caldecott Town. Or, um, free parking, was that right? Yeah, it's a free parking. It's free parking. It's quite busy. There's um, toilets there. It's pretty cool. The local gay hangout. <laughs> that's where that's where I'm gonna hang out at night. Uh, so we're gonna go check out the town, Caldecott Town. Operation, look for a bakery. Yeah. Which is Shona for some reason keeps. Yeah, right. yeah, yeah. Kona for Kona. <laughs> Shona keeps going on about cakes for some reason. You can't go to a little village and not find. I know. A traditional little bakery. It can't be a Greg's though. No, it has to be like a. It's gotta a be an original one. Yeah. Where did we go? We walked Strictly no parking. No tip no and flies. <laughs> <laughs> right. I. Oh, you go. Oh, it's more this. I'm gonna go up here a minute. I'm just gonna go see what's up here. No, I know, but it looks cool. <laughs> ah, the mind of a YouTuber. I just thought. I just thought my, you might be able to get a good view up here of like. Caldicott. Kinda. It just leads to some houses. I am very excited. Do you know why? Venturing into a place never been before. Caldicott. Caldicott. Ladies and gentlemen. Caldicott. Now I don't know. I don't know. Is it? Is, is this Newport? Monmouth, okay. So there doesn't look like there's any bakeries. There's a bistro. A bat friend. There's a Greg's. There's always a Greg's. <laughs> Everywhere you go, there's a Greg's. We've got a butcher's. But we need to find a bakery. Because that's what it's all about, isn't it? It's a very small town, to be honest. Was it a village? Is this a town or a village? Did you say it's a village? So we towns are one stop. I think it's town mate. I feel like it's how they call town AFC. You got the local aroma, <laughs> which is ram out. Cal's got fish bar. Ah! Did she see me? No, I don't know. Maybe. Light bites. Oh, charity shop. We love a charity shop. Local kebab shop. I wonder if they do salads. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Ah, baguette shop. They're bound to do cakes, aren't they? There's a huge queue outside. <laughs> Look at the massive queue outside the baguette shop. <laughs> there was a good baguette shop. I tell you what, they were lovely. Ah, ah Caldecott Town. Food. It's got some information and stuff. Um, and you have the newly developed square. Where you can come and chill out and sit down and 
I don't know actually. What, what, can, what can you look at? Hmm, I feel like sitting down. They kind of got everything here, though. There's a dentist, but there. Ah, I'll sit right here. Newport Road, there. Eh? I wonder if that's the Newport Road that goes into Newport. I doubt it. Well, I don't know. I must do. <laughs> so we've got some sort of cenotaph thing going on, which is really interesting. What? What do you want, Craig? <laughs> uh, at least we forget. They gave their tomorrow for today. That's really good, isn't it? What are these slates? Like slate look. It's all made out of slate. This is known as the Caldecott Cross by Howard Boycott. 1955. 1995. 1955. Oh, look. People put like, all the flowers and stuff on it. And obviously in the night it must be lit up. I bet that looks amazing lit up because of all the slates. It's good, isn't it? What do you think the slates represent? Do you think they represent anything? I think I think in the night when it's lit up, because you've got all the shadows, it'll look really cool. From a distance I thought it was made out of wood. <laughs> Interesting, isn't it? 1995, yeah. Yeah. 1991. Or maybe they were all. What drink they all were? Probably all from Caldecott, isn't it? Oh, yeah. You normally find like places like this. They, they. There's some other people that died here, isn't it? From this town, like. Yeah, they're all soldiers that died from here, isn't It's mad, isn't it? Oh wow, look at this. Yeah. Hey, man. Yeah. All look like. Town and stuff. It's interesting, isn't it? I love that, all the bits of history, look. Yeah. The square and Caldecott, look. Yeah, so you grab him. Oh, look at this! It's a spud boy lunch! So we went to a place here called the Baguette Shop, which you've seen a few things inside, to be honest. Turn around, goddamn you, camera! <laughs> uh, the big ad shop there. Um, you see, they got some cool pictures of what, what Caldecott looked like inside. So Amanda's gone for a salad. She's just tucking straight in there. Yeah. <laughs> that looks really nice. What do you guys get? That is very. Um, uh, what's the word? They've given you lots of tuna meal. Yeah. 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 So we, we got a couple of sausage rolls. Three. They look nice. Yeah. Are you just saying in there, right? That because someone went to buy something. And they said, oh, I'll give it to you half price because it didn't sell on the van. So they must have a van somewhere. Oh, yeah, maybe. Ooh. Which is interesting. This Biscoff cake. Oh, man, that looks oh, amazing. Mate, I can't see. I, I love this. I can't find these anywhere. Oxtail. And I thought I'd try plain paper bag. Sweet chili. Mm. Mm. It's all quite cheap. It's all like this six quid, mate. Well, this, well, this, this for, for, for me, for two drinks, two crisps, and a salad and a baguette, it cost £12. Which is not bad, really. Not bad, no. Because look, look, look at the size no of the salad. Red. No, yeah. no red. Is this your fork? Who's <laughs> access? No, it's yours. Yeah. Sorry, man. Can I just try a bit of your tuna? Get a huge chunk. Oh, I don't want the chunk. It's nice to just cut oh. it nice as well. Like, I'm just admiring it. Yeah. It's actually diced. Mm. <laughs> it's nice as well because it's got peppers in it. Mm. So what spud would you give that, then? This is a really nice sausage roll, actually. I'm not a fan of sausage rolls. This is a gold spud. Gold? Mm -hmm. It's good. As for sausage rolls, this is a good sausage roll. The sausage roll. looks good enough. Mm -hmm. It's flavourful, it's off clean. So, obviously I haven't tried mine yet, but I, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go ahead and give it a golden spread. The reason it's not platinum, because the customer service I had wasn't that good. No. I was asking her questions and she was just ignoring me. She, like, she, didn't really, she wasn't really interested. Um, but that's, you know, that's fine, they're really busy and stuff, but... Yeah, they left the standing for a while while saying nothing, did they? Mm. Mm -hmm. Sorry guys, just two seconds, we'll be there now, you know? So yeah. that's why you're not going to platinum. But so far, the food looks amazing. Um, I'm going to tuck into my... I don't know where this is my definitely baguette. a gold spot. Oh, no. <laughs> I, I, I haven't had any corn for a week. No, I don't, I've never had Dr Pepper before, so I'm going to try that now. Oh, nice, my fork's in bird shit. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so it literally sat in the middle of Caldecott Town. <laughs> it's just sat right in the middle, yeah. Tiny, isn't it? It is tiny. So this, <laughs> so this is my baguette. It looks really, really messy. What did you have? 
Hey guys, so this is not the end of the vlog just yet. We've just stopped off somewhere before the outro. Have a look at this, man. This is amazing. This is on Chapstow Road. Uh, the Celtic Manor is just by there. This is uh, the old Chapstow Road. But we just thought we'd stop off and have a look at this cool little um, remembrance kind of benches and stuff. Look at that. Isn't that amazing? And then you got this over here, look. Each one's got its own. So each one got their own kind of like remembrance to all the different regiments, look. That's your regiment, Nick, right? Right. So we're. Is that the word? Flash guards. Flash guards. That's the word. Fusiliers, isn't it? Flying corps, that one. It's amazing, isn't it? What's that one? That's Egypt, isn't it? Yeah, that's Egypt. I'm not sure what that is. For the Paras. Tank regiment. Oh, and they're all remembrance look to the people that died. For more information, scan the QR code. Langstone Community Council. That's really nice. Yeah, so there you go, guys. I thought that I thought this would be like an extra cool thing to put into the vlog um, before the um, before the end of the vlog. So outro is coming. A bear with. Right, it's getting a little bit chilly, guys. But that was um, the baguette shop. Yeah. So and that was uh, the town. There's not really much to see. Not much. Not much oh, extra. No. But pretty. Like. There's a cute queen. Well, I, was think, I was thinking of walking that way just to see what was down there, but you could see it all. It was hardly anything there. Yeah, so I think I think the vlog will end here now, guys. Let's all let's get over here and we can all, we can all do the outro together. So thank you very much for watching the content. I hope it was good. Cow went is pretty good. It needs a bakery though, a proper bakery, don't it? Caldicott. Caldicott. What did I say? Cow went. Yeah, I meant Caldicott. We've been talking about Cow went all the way here. <laughs> So yeah, so just want to say thank you very much for watching the vlog. Don't forget it guys, if you want to buy some merch, you can buy it in the link below. And if you want to become a member, 4 99 a month gets you membership access to the greatest YouTube channel in all of the land. Yes. <laughs> don't forget any other recommendations of places we go, because we can at least do this once a week now, can't we? Places every Friday, isn't it? To go every Friday. Yeah. Before every Friday, us. every Friday there's going to be like a, an adventure like this, yeah. where we go to try and we're going to explore like random Welsh towns, maybe English towns maybe and English stuff. Towns. English, yeah. Also, um, you want to do a recommend? Do you want me to mention the thing? Yeah. Um, well, you ask. So, I, if, if, well, I don't know whether you know or you don't know, but I work in a chip shop. I won't tell you a chip shop, but I work in a chip shop in Newport. We want your recommendations for the best chip shops around South Wales type area. America. Whatever. <laughs> America is a bit far, but we're going to try all the chip shops and we'll compare them to what I know in chip shops. And let's see if my chip shop comes up. Because yours is one of the best chip shops my in Newport, words, isn't it? Personally, and it is, people say it's one of the best chip shops. So let's see if it gets recommended. Basically, we're doing our own review of the best chip shop in South Wales. That's cool. So, so let us know you have, you've got to go to this place. You've got to try this. You've got to try this. And we'll go there. Even if it's just a kid's food. Fish and chips. Can't beat a fish and chips. There you go, guys. So any recommendations on fish and chips, let us know. And we will go and...